Today in this Amritka, our country India is taking rapid strides towards becoming a developed nation. In order to achieve the goal of becoming a developed nation, it is essential to have honesty and transparency in government functioning. To combat and remove corruption from government departments, the Public Interest Disclosure and Protection of Informers Resolution 2004 or PIDP Resolution in short is an important initiative of the Government of India. So let us understand first what exactly is PIDP Resolution. Under the PIDP Resolution, any person can complain against corruption in central government offices without any fear. The identity of the complainant is not disclosed and is kept confidential. So he or she does not face any kind of harassment or victimization due to the complaint. Under the PIDP Resolution, the Central Vigilance Commission has been made the designated agency to receive PIDP complaints. Also, Chief Vigilance Officers of all Central Ministries have been declared as designated authority to receive PIDP complaints. Let us understand how to file a PIDP complaint. The PIDP complaint should be in a closed envelope addressed to the Secretary Central Vigilance Commission. The envelope should be clearly superscribed with PIDP. Please remember that your name and address should not be mentioned on the envelope. PIDP complaints can be sent by speed or registered post also without name and address. On the recommendation of CVC, the Department of Posts has issued a directive to all post offices to accept envelopes inscribed with PIDP without name, address, email or mobile number. You should send your complaints only through post. While filing your PIDP complaint, remember these important points. PIDP complaints can be made against any officer or employee of the central government. Complaint can also be made against employees of any corporations established under Central Act or against employees of government companies, societies or local authorities which are under the central government. While making complaint under PIDP, a complainant must give his or her name and address at the beginning or end of the complaint letter or in an attached letter. Please do not address your PIDP complaint to any other authority either before or after filing the complaint as in these cases your identity may be compromised. PIDP complaints should be filed only in corruption or vigilance related matters. Please do not file PIDP complaints for personal matters. Complaints should not be personally related to the complainant as it may reveal identity of the complainant. A separate section has been created in the commission comprising very few officials for dealing with PIDP complaints. Except these officials, no one, even in the commission, will know of the identity of the complainant. The complaint will be masked at the initial stage itself before sending it for further investigation. If any complainant still feels that he or she is being victimized because of his PIDP complaint, he or she can apply to the commission in this regard. The Commission will take appropriate action for protection of the complainant. Come, join us in the fight to make the country corruption-free. Say no to corruption. Commit to the nation. For more information, please visit Central Vigilance Commission website. Issued in public interest by Central Vigilance Commission, Government of India.